Yankees fans and Major League Baseball fans, it is Felix yet again from NYNews.com. Like always, hola, como estas? Let's talk about how people are going crazy at the fact, because it is a fact, that Dan Clark was the first to get the information that Manny Machado was coming to the Bronx. If you don't know who Dan Clark is, he used to write for the Orioles. He came up writing for the Orioles or writing about them. He has had access to the Orioles players, has made friends with former Orioles players and Orioles players, okay? So I'm not going to throw out a source out, okay? I had private DMs by another well-respected writer, you know, who has the blue check mark, not one of these people that get a whole bunch of followers, then they get the blue check mark. I'm talking about a famous writer, okay? He told me Dan Clark was given the information because he is friends with this particular player who played for the Orioles, okay? And as a solid, he gave Dan Clark the information first as a friend. In return, Dan Clark got the hits, the traffic, the credibility, etc. And he's going to get more cred when he's proven right. Hey, if you ask me, it must have been Manny Machado himself. Now, because I know it's a fact that Manny Machado is coming to New York, I got attacked by these big YouTubers, or maybe big. You know, these guys that play video games on YouTube, build up their channels, then um, talk about baseball and make their channels about baseball. So their fan base is primarily infantile. They got little kids that watch their videos. So their mindset is going to be similar to a toddler. So then I got a whole bunch of people in my mentions, primarily Giraffe Neck Mark. You know, never said anything about the guy. Let him do his thing. You know, I've been around since 2005. I had MLB uh, websites before. You know, the thing about me, I never hate on anybody else. I promote them. You guys know, if you have a website, I say, hey, give me your blog. I'll make it famous. So these guys attacked me. He attacked me. Uh, Dawson Wright attacked me. He actually <laughs> threatened me. Dawson Wright threatened and will want to use Felix. Can you believe that? He said that I better, that I better not do a clickbait title ever again. <laughs> like it's clickbait. Because I called it official. Because behind the scenes, I have a whole bunch of people DMing me. Credible sources. But I don't put their names out. I don't have to. So because I don't play video games on this channel, you know, have a have an army of little kids that attack people once they're uh, <laughs> cult leaders like a Dawson Wright sent out a tweet and Giraffe Neck Mark, Mark Anthony 2.0. Because my audience is not of little kids, I do not have to behave like them. Okay? I don't have to attack anybody. I promote people. So that's just ridiculous. Mark and Dawson, you guys need to grow up. I mean, we're about growing Major League Baseball. I get it, Dawson. You're talking about... Major League Baseball is never going to grow. They're doing this and that wrong. Like, you're the expert on baseball. But anyways, these people that always attack me, Sam and Source, etc., they always happen to have a blog. They always happen to have their own baseball website. What I'm trying to say here is, relax. Instead of being negative, try to promote other people. If Dan Clark, who is, let's say, has a really decent reputation, if he says, I can confirm that Manny Machado is headed to the Bronx, and on top of that, he tweeted who told him, okay? Nobody in their right mind is going to put something out like that and have, let's say, their credibility completely shattered. If he's wrong, which I know he isn't because other people have confirmed it to me, he belongs in a nut house, period. So, Yankees fans, like always, leave your opinions in the comment section below. And like always, this has been Felix from NYNews.com. Share, like, and subscribe. And I will check you out next time.